when I got pretty intellectually engaged in my late teens and early 20s, it was through novels and films. That correlated with uh, a time in my life when I picked up a camera. I started watching a lot of movies that were set near my home. So this is like Paris, Texas by Vim Vendors. I probably watched when I was 18 or 19 and really fell in love with it. Days of Heaven by Terrence Malick. Five Easy Pieces, The Last Picture Show. There was something about those movies and their depiction of the landscape that I loved so much and that was, it felt near to me. And then I, I could do something like that. I mean, clearly not make these epic movies, but to channel that feeling and that view of, of America in a certain way. So that really struck a chord with me. Yeah, about 10 years ago, I lived in Bozeman, which is just west of here. And um, I was in a limited residency graduate program so I could make photographs out in the Mountain West. I didn't set out to come here to make um, Graze the Mountain Sense. It just um, was a result of first being interested in little mining towns and then getting uh, influenced by the regional literature. This place is very alluring. Um, there's a texture on everything. Um, there's a history to everything. So uh, it was really a good place to make photographs. When I started taking pictures, I set my eyes on the West. And after a while, you'll just um, um, get over those initial alluring features of the landscape and start looking around and thinking about what life is like for people in these small towns. Because when we think of America, we think of this um, kind of wealthy and powerful country. And I think the American West kind of symbolizes America in a lot of ways with the, its, its mountain peaks and um, its big open space. So whenever you do come across um, economic dispossession or environmental um, degradation or just a sense of social or societal neglect it feels a lot more pronounced uh. because it, you're measuring it against the grandeur of this landscape and um, yeah we just have this country that's supposed to be um, all about prosperity and people are routinely left out of that prosperity I mean you mentioned men just the emotion of men and I think um, historically a denial of emotion mm. um, is something I think about a lot in terms of masculinity
work I'm most interested in. It too is an act of service, but in a much different capacity. Mm. So um, I think coming from a documentary tradition where there is all of this um, sense of responsibility or obligation, as a photographer, you want to seek to affirm that however incrementally or however imperfectly, photography can help to guide our world to a better place. And lastly, a thank you to the sponsor of this video, Squarespace. I've used Squarespace for three years now, and it's one of the best investments I've ever made. I am able to easily share my work with their customizable galleries, and I can sell prints and easily get paid with their simple-to-use online shop. I can also use their third-party extensions to even ship those prints if I feel so inclined. If you want to support the channel as well as get a small discount, go to squarespace.com slash and use code Burks for 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain.